Oh yeah. <laughs> Man, yeah, I remember I used to say that. I remember. <laughs> <laughs> oh <laughs> and then <laughs> and then and then you say well, I just need to wash down my system that's just for watch <laughs> <laughs> oh man I miss having him around oh man I wonder where he is now <laughs> it was always fun <laughs> it was always fun man oh that it was it was fun it wasn't good at a lot of things but fun yep he was made for it he was made for it mm. <laughs> so what did you end up doing with the people that needed help the other day <laughs> i couldn't help all of them comfortably at least some of them had to sleep on the couch in the reception so most of them left the second day though, so it was fine. Oh. Mm. Okay. You understand why I was angry though, right? In a way, you need to understand I'm not like you though. I couldn't turn a blind eye. You cannot be that nice in this generation. They will burn you alive. You've got to start looking out for you. You remember what we used to do every Christmas when dad was still alive? I know where you're going with this, but yes, I do remember. You'd invite the whole neighborhood to come and dine with us. But can we both agree that what was fun back then is creepy or even weird nowadays? You're right, time has changed, but that wasn't the point I was driving at. See, before we dine, it always gave the speeches. And of all the speeches it gave, there's this particular quote it always say. The older you get, the less of the world you see, and the more of yourself you will discover. See, I don't have to live by the standard of the world. Loving, caring, giving hope to the hopeless. That's who I am. And no, I can't change that. Not for the world. <laughs> you have so much of that in you. It's scary. Listen, man. I'm not saying don't be nice or, uh, or be caring. See, what I am saying is be careful. There's a lot of bad people out there that can literally turn your good into evil. So just do me that favor. Be careful. Okay?
What do you want? I need to talk to you about something. Oh yeah, Mungbo. Do you think it's worth it to be nice? Did Nicholas put you up to this? Why would you say that? I overheard you guys talking earlier today, so. Yeah, well, you said I should be careful. I guess I just want to know how you feel about it. Huh. Do you remember what got us close enough to start living together? My dumb self decided to jog while it was raining. I needed a place to stay, knocked on your door, and you let me in. Imagine I didn't take you in that day. How would you feel? I don't know. <laughs> Probably would have just kept jogging. I'll get some eventually, you know. The only reason I took you in the other day was because I know you and your brother. At least he and I were close back then. Why do you care what I think anyway? Because it's becoming frustrating to be nice in this in this society. Like the world naturally accepts people that are bad instead of good. I, I don't get it. Welcome to the world. See, all I can say is just be you, man. Like, I didn't take you in the other day because I was being nice. No, I just didn't want a bad name. It could have ended up badly for me. Like, you could have raped or even robbed me. I'm glad it didn't turn out to be that, by the way. See, just be you and whoever is going to love you they'll love you for who you really are not who you were trying to be for the world <laughs> is that your way of saying you love me i'll be really in yeah come and be going come and be come and be going please i need to worship my lord i need to worship my like we cleared you bro calm down on top waiting come and be going whatever please thank you okay i'll leave you don't have to get all that's happening, bro. Love you.